There's a really nice thematic within Leicester's collection of thinking about women and how women are represented. Franz Marc's Red Woman is very much associated with his time as a Blauer writer or Blue Rider artist, a group of artists based in Munich just before the First World War. They were very interested in thinking about avant-garde strategies for representation and many members of the Blauer writer, including Vasily Kandinsky and August Macker, were all interested in the use of colour um, and I think you can see that very clearly in Franz Marc's Red Woman. It dates from 1912. It shows a woman in red, which is one of those signal colours the Expressionists used. Mark developed his own colour symbolism. Red was thought to represent matter or the earth. She's blending in with her surroundings, so there's a real sort of sense of a relationship between women and nature in this work. Because of the use of colour, it brings out the emotions it is not just a depiction of a beautiful woman seeing from behind. It is an expressionist work, which I'm sure the viewer will pick up immediately when looking at the work. The history of the painting is also very interesting because it was acquired in 1944 after a very important exhibition that took place at the Leicester Museum, which was called an exhibition of mid-European art. Really due to the incredible foresight of the director of Leicester Museum and Art Gallery, Trevor Thomas, it was a cannily chosen title because it was primarily a collection of German painting that he was displaying in 1944 during the Second World War when Anglo-German relations were not at their best. How on earth could you, at the height of the war, go and, and buy something which was so uh, blatantly related to the, uh, to the enemy? Uh, the only concession that was made was that they used the name mid-European modern art and left the G word, the German word, out of the, the title. But otherwise, that was extraordinary. The painting was lent by a very famous German expressionist collection called the Hess Collection. The Hess family decided to sell the painting to the Leicester Museum. And this work became the first painting of the German Expressionist collection as we know it now in Leicester. Works by Franz Marc are very rare. He died in 1916 during the war. He didn't leave a great number of paintings behind and so again this is what makes Red Woman a particularly unique work and it's rather lovely.